Hello everyone, welcome back to the vlog. If you're new here, my name is Shneek, and I just wanted to take you guys through what my five to nine after my nine to five looks like. I will say this isn't like my everyday five to nine, but I have been doing this routine a lot more often. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to take you guys through it. I just finished working. I was working at a coffee shop today. It just felt like one of those days to work from a coffee shop. Plus it was a lot closer to the workout that I'm going to. Um, I'm about to head over to a Pilates class right now now it is a new Pilates class that I'm going to if you watch my last vlog you'll know that I've been trying out class pass um, so it's my first time going there and it's a 30 minute drive from my apartment um, but if you know anything about Orlando traffic you know that if it's five o'clock 30 minutes actually is closer to like an hour if you're lucky so I came to this coffee shop a couple hours ago to finish working um, and now we're just a short 10 minute drive away from this Pilates class so yeah I'm not sure if they're gonna let me film while I am in there but I will at least try to get some clips of the studio so you guys can see what all that looks like and then once we're done with that I'll let you guys know how I feel take you home with me and show you what the rest of my night looks like I am so confused right now trying to find this place. Um, I am literally in a like corporate park with like trucks and the address says it's correct and it does say on class pass like that they're behind their sister company. There's no way I'm in the right place. And I'm like kind of have anxiety now because it does say to get here at least 15 minutes beforehand. And now I'm only eight minutes early if I find it in the next like, it says it's here. It's, I see the sister company. There's no way that I'm in the right place. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna try to figure this out. Okay, I finally found it. And if you guys see where I am, you wouldn't believe it because this was the most tucked away spot. And now I'm like convinced it is only for people who work at whatever this company is. Um, but it was on class pass, so I'm here. <laughs> Alrighty, so that was not what I was expecting at all. I thought I signed up for a reformer Pilates class and this was actually a matte Pilates class, um, which I haven't done before, so it was still good. I still got my sweat in. Um, the instructor was really, really sweet and there was only two other girls in this class, so it basically felt like private class, essentially. Not what I was expecting, still had a good time. Would I come back here again? I don't know, maybe. Um, they do have some hit classes, which one of the girls that was in there, um, it sounds like this is her gym that she goes to regularly, and she said that their hit classes are very similar to Orange Theory, just not as intense. Um, and I used to do Orange Theory, so I would be curious to see like what that class is about. Hit is not my favorite though. Like I quit Orange Theory for a reason because I was like dying in there. But yeah, I don't know. They it's a pretty big gym actually. They have um, a basketball court in there. They had like a full gym. They had the hit classes, Pilates classes. Um, so I don't know if I'd come back here. It's a little bit far, and it's also just like in a really weird area. I don't think I would ever do a class here that's any later than the class that I'm taking now except maybe during the summer when it gets like darker later outside um because i'll turn you guys around but like i am basically in an empty parking lot here behind some office buildings some i don't even know what these are warehouses i guess so for me being a single female taking these classes i would be too scared to walk out into this parking lot in the middle of the night like right now it's pretty light out i know there's a ton of people inside that could hear me but like later in the night when you can't really see what's around i probably wouldn't come back here but the class itself was really nice the instructor was really nice i'm gonna go home now i think nathan has started dinner already um there's one thing i actually need to pick up from the store now that i am thinking about it so i'm gonna drop by the store gonna go home eat some dinner do my skincare and just have like a nice chill night for the rest of the night. Just got home and this one is just having the best time on our bed. And like I said, Nathan already started dinner. We're doing this like, ooh, that made it real hot. But we're doing um, a pork roast. It still has about an hour and a half left, roughly. I'm gonna hop in the shower right now, do my skincare, kind of just get myself situated for the night. And once I'm out of here, it should be hopefully a lot less time left on that timer. Um, and I'll start on some mashed potatoes and do the rest of our dinner.
dinner is served. We have some cheesy garlic mashed potatoes and then we have this barbecue roasted pork. Only thing that's missing is I wish we had some veggies, but unfortunately all we had is spinach and it, I don't feel like it fit with this meal. I'm also gonna pop open the bottle of wine that I got from Publix because why not? It's a Monday night. It's, it's perfect time for wine. Alrighty, we are just eating dinner right now and watching a little bit of TV. Um, so I'm just gonna enjoy that with Nathan and not film, but I'll probably end the night by reading one of my books and like just kind of wind down before going to bed. So I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. I'm currently reading The Last Letter by Rebecca Yaros. I'm not too far into it. I actually lost my bookmark, so I need to go into my app to figure out what page I left on. But everyone on TikTok that I've seen that has read this book has completely sobbed at the end. And I am just like in need of a good book cry so I've got like this big comforter here I'm gonna get all nice and cozy and then I'm just gonna read for a couple hours well maybe not hours maybe an hour we'll see I always say that and then I end up reading until like 1 a.m. in the morning alrighty so it is 11 p.m. at night so I'm gonna go to bed but thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you liked anything in this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, leave me a comment, do all the things. Um, and as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.